using the new pipeline operator is very similar to the synchronous compose or flow way of doing things. So we'll create a parse for function here, very similar to the above. Now let's start with parse people. We'll log it out like we knew do with a normal function, put in our people string. And you can see it's going to get our objects, which is good. But watch this. We can use this new right pointing arrow, which means start with this, then feed it to the right, and we'll say filter humans. And very similar to a promise, it'll automatically execute this. And so you can see it's filtering our humans. If you think of this very similar to how you put a function inside of the dot them a promise, it's kind of the same thing as going like value and then wrapping that with functions. They effectively do the same thing other than that this is just an extra function. So if it has a single input and a single output, you can go ahead and use it just like that. And we'll keep going. We'll do our format names. It formats the names and then we can pipe that to the case names. And there you got it. You got your name.